Minister of State for Transportation, Senator Bwemi Solasaraki, has expressed dissatisfaction over low budgetary allocation for ocean research. Speaking during the annual World Hydrography Day celebration 2022 on Tuesday in Lagos, the Special Guest of Honor said hydrography remains a key driver to ocean science studies which depicts its own physical features. The minister decried the presence of wreckages, plastics and other pollutants that pose safety risks to mariners, assuring that all hands were on deck to get owners of abandoned vessels to evacuate them and wreckages cleared. Unfortunately, only about 2% of the national research budget is allocated to ocean research. Now, without adequate research funding, the data and the understanding necessary to manage ocean science and impact suffers. Countries like ours, with enormous strategic ocean assets, need the resource allocation and expertise of the Navy as a national strategy. These alarming statistics triggered the United Nations in 2017 to declare the period of 2021 to 2030 as a decade of ocean science for sustainable development. The above declaration by the United Nations aims to leverage ocean science at all levels to drive action and processes for reversing the decline in ocean health while continuing to rely on the ocean for our over-increasing needs. The Chief of Naval Staff, Vice Admiral Awal Gambo, also appreciates the level of success and innovations of the Nigerian Army since it joined the League of Chart Producing Nations. The Navy has achieved yet another milestone in developing hydrographic capacity. As this, its hydrographic office has commenced production of other navigational publications. Accordingly, two publications, namely symbols and abbreviations used on Nigeria's paper charts and rules of the road, will be unveiled later during this event. Additionally, Nigeria Navy Ship Lano will unveil its maiden magazine, the Gondola, which chronicled the ship's activities from construction till date. These huge hydrographic capacity development efforts are coming at a time the world is focused on use of the ocean sciences to achieve sustainable development.